What if I told you that a single drop of serum could oxygenate your skin, reverse aging, and keep your face looking fresh for hours? Sounds like science fiction, right? Well, that's exactly what Dior claims with their Captureless Serum, a luxury skincare product that promises to revitalize skin using their exclusive OXC treatment. But here's the real question, is it actually delivering oxygen to your skin? Or is this just another case of fancy marketing wrapped in a 97 pound bottle? Because if you know basic skin biology, you'd realize that your cells already get their oxygen from the blood. So how can a topical serum claim to oxygenate the skin? That's what we're going to uncover today, using science, chemistry, and a full ingredient breakdown. This is your channel, Skin Chemist. I'll do my best to explain to you if this product is worth it or if it's a luxury hype again. If you're tired of skincare myths and overpriced promises, then stick around because this is going to be a deep dive into the truth behind Dior's Captureless Serum. You'll learn what's inside, how the formula really works, and whether it's worth your money or just another luxury illusion. Let's get started. First things first, what is Dior Captureless Serum and why is there so much hype around it? According to Dior, this serum is inspired by regenerative medicine and features something called OXC treatment, a high-tech skincare solution that supposedly promotes skin revitalization, wrinkle reduction, and firmness. They also claim that thanks to their exoliposome technology, these powerful actives are continuously diffused into the skin for eight hours. Sounds amazing, right? But let's break this down step by step, because while the claims are impressive, we need to see if the chemistry backs it up. What is oxygenation in skincare? Before we even get into the ingredients, we need to address the elephant in the room. Oxygen in skincare. Here's the thing, your skin already gets oxygen from your blood. The idea that a serum can somehow infuse oxygen into your cells is a huge misconception. In reality, skin products cannot bypass the body's natural oxygen transport system. Your capillaries in the dermis supply oxygen to the lower layers of your skin, and the epidermis, which is the outer layer, absorbs small amounts of oxygen passively from the air. So, what does Dior actually mean when they say their OXC treatment oxygenates the skin? Well, instead of delivering oxygen, the real goal is to help skin cells use oxygen more efficiently. And that's done through improving circulation, boosting mitochondrial energy, and reducing oxidative stress, which brings us to the ingredients. Breaking down the ingredients, does the science match the claims? Let's talk about the real chemistry behind the serum and analyze whether it actually does what Dior promises. Let me briefly tell you what the role of each active ingredient is in this product's formulation to realize why this product is claiming significant changes. After I explain them briefly, I will dive deep into some of the key ingredients for OXC treatment. Let's go. 1. Hydration and Moisturizing Agents Glycerin is a humectant that draws moisture into the skin. Butylene glycol, pentylene glycol, and propanediol are humectants that help retain water and enhance penetration of other ingredients. Sodium hyaluronate and sodium acetylated hyaluronate, forms of hyaluronic acid, excellent for deep hydration and plumping the skin. Betaine is a natural osmolite that helps maintain skin hydration. Squalane is a lightweight emollient that mimics the skin's natural lipids, providing hydration and barrier support. Lecithin and hydrogenated lecithin, emulsifiers with moisturizing properties. 2. Barrier and skin repairing ingredients. Niacinamide or vitamin B3 strengthens the skin barrier, reduces inflammation, brightens skin tone, and regulates oil production. Adenosine is a skin soothing agent with anti wrinkle benefits. Tocopherol and sodium tocopherol phosphate or vitamin E derivatives antioxidants that protect against oxidative damage and improve skin barrier function. 3. Anti-aging and firming ingredients. Acetyl dipeptide, one cetyl ester, a peptide that helps relax facial muscles and reduce the appearance of fine lines. Poliolin provides an instant tightening effect on the skin. 4. Botanical extracts. Lilium candidum bulb extract, or white lily, is known for brightening and soothing properties. Jasminum officinal or jasmine flower extract, antioxidant and soothing benefits. Palmaria palmata extract or red algae extract helps with hydration and soothing. 
Tropilum magus flower, leaf, stem extract, or nasturtium extract. Rich in antioxidants, it helps improve oxygenation and skin glow. Helianthus annuus, or sunflower seed oil, is a nourishing, antioxidant-rich oil that supports the skin barrier. Limnanthes alba, or meadow foam seed oil, an emollient with excellent stability, providing long-lasting hydration. Five, skin conditioning and supporting ingredients. Loroyal lysine enhances texture and provides a silky feel. Xylitol, a humectant that improves skin hydration. Alkaligenes polysaccharides, likely a polysaccharide with hydrating and protective properties. Six, preservatives and stabilizers. Chlorphenicin and sodium benzoate are preservatives to prevent microbial growth. Citric acid is a pH regulator and mild exfoliant. Hydroxyacetophenone, antioxidant and preservative booster. Trisodium ethylenediamine disuccinate, a chelating agent that stabilizes the formulation. The rest of them are the ingredients that only act as structural materials for the texture or appearance of the final product, and they don't act as active ingredients in this formulation. Now that we know the role of every single ingredient in the formulation briefly, let's get back to the Alexi treatment and the ingredients involved in it. Since there are too many ingredients in this formulation, there might be a chance for some ingredients to react with each other, which can result in deactivation, incompatibility, or the production of harmful products. Let's see what the possible reactions or interactions are in this formulation. Myosinamide may become unstable and convert into nicotinic acid, which can cause irritation if the pH is too low due to citric acid, so keeping the pH around 5 to 6 is ideal. Alcohol can reduce the hydrating effects of hyaluronic acid, though this is balanced with humectants like glycerin and butylene glycol. Iron oxide may accelerate the oxidation of vitamin E, so the inclusion of trisodium ethylenediamine disuccinate as a chelating agent helps maintain stability. Similarly, hydrogenated lecithin can increase the oxidation rate of vitamin E, so proper packaging like airless pumps would be beneficial. Some peptides, like acetyl dipeptide, one cetyl ester, may degrade in the presence of sodium surfactant, which could reduce their anti-aging effects over time. Additionally, the presence of alcohol and fragrance could increase skin penetration, potentially leading to irritation in sensitive skin, though this is mitigated by soothing ingredients like betaine, niacinamide, and botanical extracts. As you can see, for all the potential reactions, some ingredients are there to stop them. One of the most important ingredients in this formula is tropilum magus extract, also known as nasturtium extract. Now, this is where things get really interesting. This plant extract has been shown to increase cellular oxygen efficiency, meaning it helps cells adapt to low oxygen conditions and improves how they use the oxygen they already have. Essentially, it stimulates skin respiration, making cells more efficient at producing energy using available oxygen. This can lead to brighter, more radiant skin and improved cell turnover, which is a big deal when it comes to anti-aging. Then we have niacinamide or vitamin B3, which is famous for boosting blood circulation and reducing oxidative stress. This means it helps deliver more oxygen and nutrients to the skin, making it look healthier and more radiant. Another key player is adenosine, which is actually involved in cellular energy production. ATP is the molecule that powers all biological processes, including skin renewal, collagen synthesis, and repair. By enhancing ATP levels, adenosine helps your skin function at its best, reducing wrinkles and improving elasticity. Then there's sodium tocopherol phosphate, a stabilized form of vitamin E that works synergistically with vitamin C to protect against oxidative damage and boost collagen production. Now, quick break. If you're enjoying this breakdown and want more no-nonsense, science-backed skincare content, make sure to subscribe to the channel and hit that like button. It really helps support the channel and brings more content like this your way. All right, back to the chemistry. One more interesting ingredient is polyulin, which gives that instant skin tightening effect. This is a polysaccharide that forms a thin film on the skin, making it appear firmer and lifted. But keep in mind, this is temporary. And finally, let's talk about Dior's exoliposome technology. 
While they don't disclose the exact science behind it, the presence of hydrogenated lecithin and alkaligenes polysaccharides suggests that they are using a liposome system to encapsulate active ingredients, allowing for better penetration and controlled release. But without specific clinical studies, it's hard to prove whether it truly delivers eight hours of diffusion, as they claim. Is Dior Capture Le Serum worth 97 pounds? Scientifically speaking, the ingredients do support better oxygen metabolism, hydration, and skin renewal. However, the idea that it oxygenates the skin in a literal sense is misleading. The real mechanism here is boosting circulation, enhancing cell energy, and protecting against oxidative stress. That said, is it worth 97 pounds for 30 milliliters? Well, while the formula is well designed, there are many other serums with similar ingredients for a fraction of the price. If you're looking for alternatives that offer similar results without the luxury price tag, here are a few options. One, the ordinary niacinamide 10% plus zinc 1%, great for improving circulation, oxygen efficiency, and brightening. It costs you around five pounds. Two, Ceosarx Advanced Snail 96 Mucin Power Essence contains adenosine for ATP production and skin regeneration. This one would cost you around six pounds. Three, Paula's Choice C 15 Super Booster has vitamin C and tocopherol to fight oxidative stress and boost collagen. This one is more expensive than the previous ones. It's 44 pounds. Four, Benton Snail B High Content Essence contains niacinamide, adenosine, and peptides for hydration and skin repair. This one is around 14 pounds. So, if you want science-backed results, Dior's formula isn't bad. But if you want the same benefits without spending nearly 100 pounds, there are cheaper alternatives. Let me know in the comments if you've tried any of these or if you have your own go to oxygen boosting skincare product. And if you enjoyed this deep dive, hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss another science-based skincare breakdown. See you in the next one.